Hi guys, welcome to another electronic cleaning video tutorial. Now, this is my first tutorial on data logic programming. We will be using Win for data for data, data logic programming, and the PLC I'm using is FedEx. This will be a series of more than 25 videos, and in which we will cover all the contacts which are used and uh, at the end we will be uh, making four or five uh, projects the uh, today's video tutorial is about uh, the comments how we can add uh, different comments in a program so let's start click on new so before you click okay first of all you will have to uh, specify uh, the type of plc you are using so click on the added these are the different types the one I'm using is APS and it has 14 pins and that is that uh, it has add inputs and six outputs and the model that is MA and MC so the one I'm using that is MA and click OK and OK now here you can see on the left side comment over here is a program unit comment network number and element comment so let's use this one program unit comment program programmer name and uh, click OK and OK. Well actually uh, as, as uh, you know that uh, comments are optional. If you don't use it, it won't have any effect on the programming but it's a good programming practice if you use comments because later on when you will come back and check your reporting after one or two years or six or seven months. So at the time you open the program, it will give you information that the program is written by whom or and, and what is the purpose of the program now let's add a very simple instruction and these are the uh, you can click over here and click here and then click zero or you can use uh, shortcut keys click over here and click O on the keyboard and write Y zero now in FedEx PLC X represent inputs and uh, y represent output so data we will be having a very detailed lecture on this for now we will be using uh, only the comment so uh, now click on the element comment over here you can see that uh, x0 is available because i have already used it over here that is so basically uh, button one right now why it is used and what's its purpose uh, let's a description that this button is used to turn, turn on and off a light and okay So now you can see that is button one. Now, uh, for example, you have more than uh, 50 or 60 buttons uh, in a program. So then uh, later, uh, it's, it's hard to find that which button is used for which button. So if you click on this and uh, click on the arrow, from the description, you can read that what was the purpose of this uh, button, why it is used. So over here you can place it that this button is used to turn on or off a light. Okay. And now uh, let's uh, network. And, uh,
button one and done. Uh, and I So that is button one and I can. If, if you want to add uh, any information, any information for this code, so you can write it over here. Just double click and add anything you want. And uh, for example, let's add another one. Shortcut, click A on the keyboard, X, one, and uh, click OK, and click O on the keyboard, and uh, Y1. So again, you can click on the element, and uh, for example, button to increment. And now click on the network and uh, click over here. So that's how the uh, the comments are added. That is the program unit comment, and it is a network comment, and these are the element comments. If you like my video, subscribe to my channel for the upcoming videos and uh, please like my videos, leave a comment and share it with your friends and thanks for watching.